What's happening, folks? If you can hear me, please give me a thumbs up. I'm good. I see Dustin in here. I see a comment from Dustin. All right, I see Anthony Shuba with a boom. Perfect. So you guys know we're doing this live from StreamYard. So we're not 100% there yet, everybody. Next week, we will be. What's super cool, though, is wherever you're watching us, I can see that. So Robert and Anthony, I can see you're watching us from YouTube. Nate, you're watching us from YouTube. David, Caitlin, Dustin, I can see you guys watching us on Facebook. This is awesome. So this is going to be our new streaming ability. We're going to go between Facebook, YouTube, and also Twitch. So you're going to be able to watch us on any three of those and interact with us. I can see all the comments. It looks like it's coming through. Tyler, your comment just came through. Now you're seeing this background still, but now you can see our banner down below so you can see how it works, what you can type in to win that item. You can see our cute little logo in the right-hand corner. If you're watching earlier, you saw our 30-second countdown, which will actually go to a really cool intro and a really cool outro eventually. So it's going to be great. I'm just going to wait for Sam to hop on her laptop so she can keep up with these comments with me. But we're super, super excited for this. Um, next week, like I said, what's up, Chris Pyle? Say next week, we're going to have it where we'll be on camera also. So you're going to be able to see the behind the scenes, which means I'm going to have to stop itching my butt a lot. Um, that's a lie. I don't really itch my butt a lot. Joe Carlson, I saw that come through. And I see you're watching us from Facebook. Phil, I see you're watching us from YouTube. This is awesome. I love seeing this. This is great. So again, sorry for the late start. It was taking me a bit. I'm doing this off my phone. Um, and, and I had to get into StreamYard to able to do this. So we are a couple minutes late. Chris Lee, I see your claim test. Thank you. Corey, I saw yours. Thank you. Ryan, how you doing, man? Tay Brian, one, I can see you. Yes. So again, thank you guys very much for tuning in. We're going to start the sale here in just a second. Um, probably with all this going on, we'll probably start doing some funny video content too, just to keep it going. <clears throat> Rachel, I see yours. Curtis, I see yours. Phil, I see yours. Aaron, I don't know if you have to go in your privacy settings. This is what I've been telling everybody. From what I'm reading with all these new privacy settings, I know on our end, <clears throat> uh, I, on our end, I know that we change our privacy settings so that we can see everything. You may, again, have to go into yours. Ben, I see yours. Tammy, I see yours. Sean, I see yours. Evie, I see you. I see you. You see me. Sam, you coming? I know, but I need you on your laptop so we can see all these. <clears throat> yep, Ryan, I see you. Dustin, I see you. Ethan, I see you. Appreciate all that. Aaron, uh, I saw your comment about the not seeing comments. It was work related, I promise. Jesse, I see you. Do you see what I'm seeing here, though, with this? No, I'm getting to it. So it looks like we got 52 viewers, nine thumbs up. And I see a ton of comments. Yeah, Nebula, I see your stuff. Brandy, I see you. Where am I? David, you're on Facebook. You're on Facebook. It's the creator appreciation system. I'll just make a piece for you on the paper towel. Thank you So, now the only thing you may not be able to see if you're on that. I don't know if you can be on the same thing as me. That's why we'll need the laptop moving forward. But, um. I see Nebula's claim test. Yep. Or her note. <clears throat> Jason, I see you. I don't know if I see yours. It may have gone way too whatever. Sorry. What's up, Archie? But hopefully this will... Uh... If you guys are on Facebook, can you see the banner on the bottom? Do you see all this that I'm seeing? I see. Oh, I'm Sam fine. sees it, so we're good. Awesome. Okay. And really Sam's good. on Facebook. Okay. Well, that's awesome. Megan, I see you. But I'll have it... Oh! When I pulled it up on my phone, that's what I... Yeah, that's how it started. I know, but it's weird that it... Didn't just hop. Sorry, guys. Not trying to make you seasick. I'm trying to line this thing oh, up. See, once again, on the laptop, it's not showing all those, but on my phone, it is. Okay. All right. First thing of the evening. 
price check. I'm pretty sure you guys can see this, but I want to double check. If I have it right there, let me know the price. See, this is awesome. This is awesome you can do this. You just wait till you see our intro outro next week. We have an intro outro video. Once again, I would like to reiterate that Sam showed you this month. I see a lot of Sam I see a lot of thirties. To you a year ago, a year ago, and we started. I'm not going to say this, but Sam reminds me a lot of somebody else. Chris Pyle, whatever. That Samantha explained this stuff a year ago, and we started this. And Brad just wants to give himself credit. I'm not giving myself so, credit to anything. Uh, you know what? So there, there's a bunch of pops I didn't bring out then. Obviously, these are all new pops. So we'll have to get these older ones out. That's what I thought. All right, next. Well, I shouldn't say next up. First up. Y'all ready? We're starting at the new way. You guys see the rules at the bottom. First up for $20, we have number 160 in Spider-Man. Remember, you see how to claim on the bottom of the screen. First one on my screen gets it. I believe we only have one My Hero Academia. And let me tell you. It's a big one. It's a big one. It's a big one. Nebula, pull that coin purse out if you want it. Will you please write the prices for these and then I'll I got Aaron Steele. We got side Aaron as well. Can you explain all the thingies? All the thingies? You know, like how you claim and... I, I did the who, what, and the which, where. <clears throat> Bye. Bye, Taylor. Have a good night. Hey, Nate, is this coming through okay on uh, YouTube? Now that I see you're on YouTube. Yeah, Sean, it's because I used pen. Can I use the marker? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it's good. New comments. That is so cool. It says new comments. Oh, my God. This is adorable. <clears throat> yeah. This one wasn't in the picture, was it, so, earlier? By the way, I don't know if on Facebook it doesn't do this, but on this app, if I'm, if I'm up higher reading comments, it says new comments and points down. I am super excited about this new way. Um, Carrie, I wasn't here earlier, but I haven't seen any doctors. YouTube is fine. Awesome, Ben. Are Thank you so much. Ones that you, might be looking for? you guys rock, by the way. Thanks for hanging in there with us for everything. $32. We got Carol from The Walking Dead. Who? Uh, 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 and Sam's always uh, putting up uh, with uh, me. Uh, oh, uh, you're uh, so nice, uh, Brad. Uh, uh, uh. Look at this. is imaginary towel. <laughs> I see you, Rachel. I got Aaron Steele again. You're the best. Oh, gosh. I love why? Why is that? What do you mean? Why wouldn't she eat it if you didn't bring it to her? Because she was playing back She's busy. Oh, so busy. Because she... She's busy. She probably wouldn't get up until after the sale. By that point, it'd be cold and gross. So, I owe you, Taylor. Corey, we don't have it linked to Facebook yet. I will get stuff up. Uh, this is honestly, this is a lot, lot of new stuff we're we're transitioning through. So, we'll get that linked up. You guys will be able to see it. For twenty eight dollars, we have number one twenty Daredevil. It's a whole new ball game, folks. A whole new ball game. Oh, Tomas. Hey, when you Let say me... you're hunting for movie versions, what do you mean? Sam's talking to me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We've got two new chase boxes tonight. I'll fill you in in just a second. I got to run him back. Dustin, I don't know whether that's supposed to be boots sarcastic pants, or boots not. And pants, boots and pants, I don't know boots anymore. And no Daredevil fans? Is that what I'm seeing? Is that what I'm seeing? You don't have to do this one right away. It's just. <clears throat> All right. I think he's been spun around enough times. Right round. Right round. Appreciate it. I feel like this camera shows more, too. Like, look at my screen. Normally, I don't feel like I get that much in. Sam, you got this next one. I'm going to run back real quick. I feel like, oh, wait, no, here's the ball and stuff. Yeah, you've got, like, all the newest ones out. No, these are all, these aren't new. Any of that wow. sports stuff. We got a lot of sports tonight, too, folks. And then you're good. Oh, people want to know Oh, about... Dustin Ruth claiming Deer Devil. Dustin Ruth is? Uh-huh. Okay. I know people are going to want to know about the chase boxes, though, so let's get to that right away. 
<sighs> All right, Dustin, got you on, Dear Devil. Um, Chris Powell, you're going to love tonight because we have one case only of the Funko Soda Endgame Iron Man with Chase. And then we have the Funko Soda Bullwinkle Fearless Leader with Chase. So we got some brand new two-day and fun chase boxes. Oh, shoot. Oh, All right, here comes not quite a big one, but it's the biggest of the night. For 70 bucks, we got the OG Civil War Scarlet Witch, number 133 with a soft case. Hey, Andrea, welcome in. Hey, Andrea. How's it going? I haven't seen you forever. Oh, I get it, Carrie. I get it. You could always just said it's Carrie, and we would have got it. Does YouTube comments have pictures? Like, would it, like if you put her same profile picture? I think, can you do yeah, that? yeah, because Nate... Uh, Nathan Kroll's coming up, but his picture shows up. There you go. See, characters use the same Their picture. avatar. Their avatar shows up for everything. So, the Scarlet Witch from Civil War for $70. Number 133. I heard the other day that she got bullied off of Oh, her. cool. What? Uh, we got Jesse on, night, or on uh, Twitch watching. Nice. Is the chat mostly on Facebook? I don't I don't know. That's a great question. I'm wondering if everybody can see everybody's comments through this. I would assume so. Can you see everybody's? Because this is on Facebook. Can you see the Twitch comment and everything? On here, yes, I can. Right? That's everybody. Does that look correct? No. No, you got to scroll the other way to go. Aaron says, I'm not able to see anybody else's. I was seeing Aaron's. Aaron's on Facebook, though. Oh. So who is on YouTube. Nathan Kroll is on YouTube oh, and Jesse is, is on. So then we're only going to be able to go off of one screen. It's always going to be off the one screen. Oh, I guess if they're on Facebook, they only see Facebooks. That'd be interesting, though, how that works. I'm going to have to show you my, like I said, I keep telling you, I'm going to have to show you my friends and show you how. Ooh, I paid for this. Should have listened to Sam. I got to assume there's a way you can see them all. Well, I can tell you so far, Scarlet Witch is still. Yeah, Karen, I see your comments. Absolutely. So I think what it is, as of right now, unless there's a way to transition it, YouTube sees YouTube, Facebook sees Facebook, and Twitch sees Twitch. I'm pretty sure, but I'm going to verify. There, there are programs that you can see all, but. Should I listen to this side? New Rick and Morty Sunday. May I have the marker, please? Yeah. I'm just trying to see if there's a way I can see or everybody can see these comments. Because I guess that is the one thing. I guess that is the one thing. Um, with other people, they need to see these. But all right. So, oh, I got, wait, 453. What's 453? Kevin Hollenberg says claim 453. I don't know. Maybe he's high. I don't know. Hey, Kevin, what is number 453? I don't see that one. So Ben says no cross-platform comments here. I'm on all three platforms. Oh my God! I can put users in timeouts. So if we had, if we had sad face, what's this exo exit solo layout? What's that mean? I'm afraid to do this. Yeah, you shouldn't mess with it during it. Well, it says exit solo layout though. What happens if I do that? Maybe now. Can you see all the comments now? No. He's from the future. <laughs> uh. Said it by mistake. You got it. Okay. So Scarlet Witch has been up there long enough. All right. There we go. Oh. 
Next up for ten dollars. It's too late. I already pushed the button. I shouldn't have pushed the red button. I pushed the red button. Number three ninety. We have Negan. He's from the future. That's that's probably true though. That's probably true, Dustin. Claim yeah, three ninety from Aaron Steele. I've got. Okay, this is going to be a hot one. $24. GameStop exclusive, number 837, Venomized Gwenpool. I have two of these, two of these at $24. God, Chris, do we want to talk about this right now? All right, so I have Caitlin from YouTube, and I've got Ryan Loveless. That's a bad. I haven't heard it. So, okay, let's talk about this for just a second. But I did say Caitlin from YouTube got the first one. Ryan Loveless got the second one. What's up, Toys Hunter? So you guys know there is a little rumor that I heard that if you're on YouTube, you see stuff maybe faster. There was a rumor I heard that. So, I'm super excited for the Masters of the Universe from, um, oh my God, really? Kevin Smith, okay? The one thing I'm not excited for is if you are a Alan Oppenheimer fan or vintage Skeletor, right? Original. The one thing about it is all you see, whether you close your eyes or not, is the Joker. When you hear Mark Hamill's voice doing Skeletor, all you legit hear is the Joker. So That's fair. I haven't heard it. I but it's, I, it, it turned me off. His laugh is good. His laugh for Skeletor was actually good. That's how they started out the whole preview. But then as soon as he started talking, I'm like, fuck, it's literally the Joker. I can't do this. But I'm guessing maybe Alan Oppenheimer couldn't do it that much. Maybe he can't do that voice that long. So I'm really hoping it's going to like stick to me how old is alan now he's gotta, be he's gotta be almost 80 has to be if not older it's one of those like once you hear it you can't unhear it as that character i feel like with some role so it's like once you hear mark hamill as the joker and it sounds slightly similar you're it sucks like, oh. it's not like slightly similar it's like dead on joker it really i was really nervous like aaron i i did not <laughs> that's really yeah that's really why we got that black button <laughs> All right, Sam, I think we need to follow this one up with the other one, though. Where is it? $13 from White Man Can't Jump, number 977, oh, Billy Hoyle Pyle. or Woody Harrelson. Chris Pyle, he never, he never played that. What? He never said that didn't happen. Let's get that straight. Funny group. Funny group. You know what? One, I got Aaron Steele for one claim. I do have several of these folks. Get yourself a Billy Hoyle. All right, so I got, I've got Ben Gonzo, Aaron Steele, Chris Lee, and Corey Homer so far. There should be a full box, I'm pretty sure. I'm trying to find the box. Is this one? I need a hero. Where's the box? I don't know. All right, give us just a minute to find this box of Woody's. Oh, right here. Sam found the, bo the Woody box. You know what? He's always going to be Woody and Cheers for me. What? Cheers That's was the, the one first role? thing I used to watch. I was the first thing I saw him in. And I used to watch Cheers religiously. All right, so we're still there. <laughs> Love that chicken from Popeyes. That hasn't been on yet tonight. I know, but Dustin just said it, which made it I stick know, in my head. I know, I know, but I'm just saying. All right. So, ooh, so maybe we're putting the traffic down. All right, so Ben, Aaron, Chris Lee, Corey Homer. I'm not gonna, <laughs> I'm not gonna have enough space over here. That's for dang sure. You may have to take some as we go. 
Just hand them the mail, put them back there. Here's these for now. Beautiful. And then Aaron Steele. I gotta get Aaron Steele's there too. All right, we're going to follow that up with his partner in crime for 11 bucks. You got Sydney Dean, 976, also known as AKA Blade, AKA The Great Black Hype, AKA Wesley Snipes. I've got Corey Homer. Oh, geez, they're flying through. Okay. So I have Aaron Steele, Ben Gonzo. I believe I believe Jim Cleland was trying to get in on that. Corey Homer. Let me just verify how many we have first, but it does start with Aaron Steele. I'll check up front. Oh. Uh, well, okay. Jim doesn't need one, so two. I need one for Corey and Chris. Oh, my God. It's so popular. Okay. Well, we may have to snag one from back then. God, what's with you and songs tonight? I don't know. Um, well, Corey, it's weird how these these comments are jumping on my screen so fast, it seems like, compared to before. It's weird. Like, sometimes it felt like it took forever for these comments to get up, and they're, like, just jumping on my screen. And they're they're coming through quicker. I don't know how it works, but it's all of a sudden boop 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 boop. So Chris Lee, I'll find you one. Corey, I got yours. Next up for fourteen dollars, we have Diego from the Umbrella Corp. One 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 got four. Multiple of those. Multiple. You gotta find. Write it down. So <clears throat> Carrie, I see you. <clears throat> Got it. I didn't know if he had a dog or wolf. <laughs> that one people are going to go crazy over. I thought this was Game of Thrones. Because I only saw the wolf. I thought it was ghost or something. Franks and beans? Sorry, Dustin, I didn't see your comment. I was looking for some other Funkos here. See, was anybody else, were you like me where you started watching the Umbrella Corp and then you were just kind of shortly after, or the Umbrella Academy, and then shortly after you're like, yeah, there's better shows. Doing that still? Yeah. Okay. So Dustin. I see you, Megan. All right, next up for $13. From Pokemon, we got Mew, number 643, with a little crease right there. Pokemon, gotta catch a ball. You teach me. I'm guessing. I'm guessing. Caitlin Snag and Mew it says new, but I got. I got the feeling. 
<clears throat> it's so cute when Loki sings the Pokemon song. It's adorbs. I mean, it always is to their parents. It's true. I need like five more of him. With his sass. I've heard him. Have you heard how sassy it, that kid is? Yeah, and if, if that was my kid, whoo. Why would he say when you, you were here? It's not when he was here. What I hear when we're playing video oh games, gosh, the way he talks to you. Yeah, Eleven like, bucks. We've got side out. The other night when I had to get seven eighty one. He was scratching me, like he was like a cat. He was getting mad. And he was hmm, and he walked away. And that's when I was like, I gotta go. I had Damn. to take care of that crap. Megan, I've seen all your comments. I see you claim Psyduck. Psyduck? Megan, I'm Caitlin. looking at the Facebook right. so I don't see yours. So I've got Megan and Caitlin for Psyduck. <laughs> Who was that that came in that one time and said we had to... Oh, Dusty. We had to do a voice. Voice off. It's probably one of the funniest things I've ever heard in an interview. Sam's jam. Fuck me, really? What? <laughs> you see what I did? <laughs> uh. Yeah. I haven't gotten into that either. I saw actually. the first season. I wasn't that impressed. I've heard it gets a lot better. But then once again, he got, starts going out with the lady in the show. I'm like, doesn't every show do that? That gets annoying. So this is what I did. I got it corrected for you, Meg. But Psyduck claims Psyduck. Papa's. Well, there we go. Okay. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, sports fans, we're starting this one off fun tonight. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. Only at target number one, Muhammad Ali. Woo! I'm a poet. What's up? That totally rhymed. Someone needs that Muhammad Ali, and he's in a protector case. I'm the greatest of all time. Really? I'm a little heartbroken here. A little heartbroken here. All right, Sam slammed this group earlier if you were watching the comic I sale. Did you did. Oh, you did. You did. I was talking about when you get a saw stuck in your head and but you start to hate it. Is he supposed to be like that? That was my reference. Yes. He, oh, cool. Okay. I made sure. I here we go. Same. We have number nine pop albums. I want a highway to hell. Yeah, ACDC. Can you tell me what movie this was from? What, what movie was this from? That song. A lot of movies. Can anybody tell me the classic horror movie this was from? And I've got Connor and Ryan claiming one. We do have three of them total. I know somebody will get it. I'm just waiting to see who the first one will be. No, not that. Yes, Cody. Yes. Maximum Overdrive. Really? It's a Stephen King movie. And it's about basically truck, well... Semi trucks. That's like alive and. Just, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And it has that big goblin or whatever on the front. I haven't seen the movie, but I've seen the Futurama reference. Of course. Futurama was an amazing show. Yeah, but you know what? You never see the real meaning behind it. You just see these garbage TV versions. Excuse you. Futurama was not garbage. I agree, First Corey. Off. It was actually, one, that was one of those movies that actually did instill a little fear in me. I have watched a lot of other Stephen King movies, though. I'm not impressed. I 
I was I saw We have two of these, right? No, I don't see another one. Yeah, we do. Oh yeah, we do. All right. You're right. Trust me. Get your clam ready. Number 78. This is a Funko exclusive. Very hard to get. For $42, you have the snake eyes with timber that everybody wanted. Honey at the ATM. <laughs> What'd you do, Jim? What did you do, Jim? I've got Aaron Steele, Brandy Hoffman. Oh, Aaron Steele switched over to YouTube. Woo! Uh, Ryan, yes, you did get ACDC. Oh, you ready? All right. I feel like that'll go on the back burner real quick. It is an impressive pop. It really is. I saw it and I'm like, this is really cool. All right. Next up for 35 bucks, a super adorable pop. We will. Where that shipment hasn't come in yet with all those pop protectors and stuff, has it? I ordered that like last week for thirty-five dollars, brand new today. Number one hundred two, Stitch on Rocket. Yeah, Connor, both you and Ryan got that ACDC. We had three of them, so you both got one. Thunderstruck. Hopefully, you heard that. Yeah, I'm totally deaf. <laughs> Whoa, okay, okay, okay. See, these pop up so quick. We do have multiple of those stitches. Okay, so here's the deal. I don't, Reese and Kate's Poke Hub. I need to know your name. I think I know it's Reese, but I just need to know. I've got Rachel, John Schneider, Ryan Loveless. Whoa, how many do we have? We've got six. So, Reese, if I'm right, I think it's Reese from, oh, Ryan Riggs. There we go. Okay, Ryan, am I right though? Is it, are you in with Reese or no? Are you up in Invergrove Heights? Dude, we get like all six months. Yeah, because they got three too. I just figured this would sell tonight. No, I was asking to know what to hand you. Oh, sorry. I have four sold. Okay. Uh, never mind. I got five sold. Oh, Ryan Michael. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'm right, though. I got Rachel Lorandi. Uh, John Schneider. Timmy Gangas? What? Loveless. Uh, oh, John Schneider said no for me, I guess. So Dustin, just put Dustin Rube on his. That's fine. So that should be right. Okay. So that would be it then. That would be pretty funny, Carrie. Next one, we have multiple of these for $11. We have one, 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 three from the Umbrella Academy, Ben. What the hell are you singing? That Pokemon song is stuck in my head. Oh, God, girl. 
you are like a seven-year-old trapped in a 40-year-old woman's body. You know what I meant. Hey, I used to get bullied in school. School so being bullied at work isn't much different. Oh, please. I used to get bullied too. It's nothing like that. Not. $33. We got the wet bandit two pack from Best Buy. Okay, you say that. Not the, the sticky bandits. Time, imagine a male saying those same things and smacking a girl. I never smack you, though. But that's what happened to me. Yeah, but I would never do that to you. Mmm. Because you claim that you're a gatekeeper bullying, apparently. What? Phil Carlson getting the bandits. What? Aaron. I don't see his comment. For twenty dollars, we have the eight bit Stranger Things Demogorgon number twenty. He said, "Must have been a Sam special." Who is Ned? Ooh, is this like a riddle? It says net and out? Where does it say net and out? Oh, I wonder if it was like right away when I did it because I was trying to hurry to get into the sale. Sports fans, you're up. 13 bucks. We got number 148, Patrick Mahomes with helmet on. Yeah. I, dude, I'm guessing it was because I was in a hurry and I probably didn't proofread and just sent it through so I get this thing going. We were we started a little, couple minutes late. All right, I have Karen first on my screen for the Pat Mahomes. Don't worry, folks, you'll have another chance at one very similar. Next up for 33, Star Wars fans. Number 90, the t the fighter pilot. Shamol, I can see you. Oh, that must be Mole. Is that Megan? Shamol? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Where's the message? She's on Twitch now. Probably. It's usually, well, no, I don't know. It's usually she's Shmoel. Shmoel. Oh, -S -S oh. Uh, Jason, it, Karen did pop into my screen before you, yes. John, yes, I can see Twitch chats. I can see YouTube and Facebook. I got Johan claiming number 90. Oh, that's you, John Schneider. And you did, are you on different platforms? That's hilarious. Why is it schmo? Do you know? You don't know? What? It should be make all wood. Well, you know what? Number. Next up for 24, you've got an OG here. We got number one, Darth Vader. With soft case. This one I completely agree with. Hang on.
I mean, there should be a lot more, yeah. See? Number one, Darth Vader. <laughs> this one's actually pretty cool. For the price, having like the OG Darth Vader I too. Like we should start these as a pair. I like it. Give those people get the but wait, chance. is it ninety six and ninety? Oh, it is. You would have thought the other one would have been that. Why? Oh, you mean the one we already did? <laughs> get out of here! My God. All right, so Darth Vader's been up there long enough. I really feel like I may end up getting this one just because of the significance of it. Oh, Johan claimed it. Son of a bitch! Why would you want... What's the significance of it? This is like the OG Darth Vader. What? It's kind of a big... Yeah, it's kind oh, of a big deal. That and I, you, didn't, you didn't warn me. I would have gotten it. That's what I'm saying. I was thinking about grabbing it. I'm not huge into Funkos, but yeah, that's the OG Darth Vader. You would have gotten it for Sam because she's awesome. I th- oh, should we go over what I got you? Where did you get me? Really? Yeah, really. Did someone forget Black Cat? First appearance of Black Cat? Oh, but you saved the better copy for yourself, so. Mm. Wow! Wow! <laughs> hey, I'm going to give you this because I got a better copy. Or just the simple fact, you got a Spider-Man Black Cat number one. You would have brought it in and I would have bought it. Next up, but did you? No. Next yeah. up, number 120, well, Lamar you Jackson. Me was because you got a better copy. No, that's not true, actually. I think it is. I think it is. It's not true. You just happen to get a better copy at the same time. Why a better that, graded copy. When I bring it in to sell at the store? You, no, it came in yep. like the same Case time. Case closed. No, no. True. Carrie, it's because you haven't followed my Twitch. My Twitch is pretty awesome. Lamar Jackson. I just blocked Brad so he can't come on. And he have. Me. Did he really have those chops when he was new? I gotta do it the other way. What are we doing this as then? Okay. Uh, Shane, I believe we do, yes. But next up, we're doing this as a pair for only 22 bucks. Get yourself a Tom and Jerry. You can put T and J, you can put Tom and Jerry, you can put 1096, 1097, however you want to do it. All right, I got Ryan Loveless. I've got Ben Gonzo. I got Evie Olsen. Three. Three pairs. That's that. That's all, folks. That's all, folks. I didn't know you were a Gretzky fan. My dad is. I'm trying to sell Gretzky's rookie card and get it graded. Whoa. You're very aggressive this evening. Gretzky's OG rookie card. Sam's got it. Send it get graded. Send your offers in now. Posted on a What's group, up, Matt? On a group to try to get help. And then I got a mixture of people harassing me and being mean. Like, that's a fake. And then others trying to, like, get it for, for like, 300 Sounds like the same people. R.I.P. That's the same thing. Boss. All right. This next one, honestly, is probably one of the coolest pops I have seen in a very long time. The only reason I say this is because I've never seen anything like this. And I don't know if I will. For $34, which seems super cheap for a four-pack, 
you've got Wayne Gretzky on all the teams he's played for. I don't know if you've ever seen it. I don't know if you ever will again. I guarantee somebody will get this. Super cool. Two totally different shows right now? Really? How come? Oh, he's stuck. Jim Cleland, that's a great, great, great get. For the price, that to me is insane. Well, Facebook is always a bit behind. That's why I'm saying. That's why we're doing this. Uh, do you have anything on this one? Oh, same one. Got it. Okay. You know what? Let's do one of those. Let me do this one real quick. Yeah. Okay. So for 15 bucks, guys, we're staying with the sports theme. We've got 107 Julius Irving, and I have two of these. Whoa. Hey. What? Did you see that he sent us three stars? Oh, I can't see that. That's weird. Yeah, Matt. So we're cross-platforming now. Thank you for the stars, by the way. We're cross platforming, so we're on YouTube, we're on Twitch, and we're on Facebook all at the same time right now. I see Jim Cleland is even on uh, YouTube now. What's awesome, it gives you guys different opportunities to get on different and uh, try to get the quick bid in. Dr. J for 15, I've got two. Oh, that's good to know, Leslie. One of the best to ever play on the hardwood. Yay, Leslie. One minute, sir. Square wants me to do a survey for them. They're not going to do that. All right, you know what I'm doing. You know what that means. First six people to get in, $15. You get into this vinyl soda endgame Iron Man with Chase Box. You're going to have to do it on yours because I can't you ready? see all the same comments. Yep. Holy shit, they all come in at once. That's Woo! why it's so weird. Holy shit, that's weird. Sorry, everybody. I've got Pyle. I can tell this is Chris Pyle. He's number one. Karen to win is number two. Evie Olsen is three. Wait, you're too fast. Sorry. Ready for the next? Yep. Jason Meserol. I hope I said that right, Jason. Wait, how do you spell his last name? M E S S E R O L E. M E S S E R O L E. I've got Dustin Hoffman, Shane Everett. Jason says, Yup. So this is why this is crazy on this platform, you guys. When everybody comments on this, it pops through at once, which actually makes it easier because these two screens are different. It literally will give me the top six immediately. So He's this is Everett, so yes, cool. Right? Yeah, Shane Everett. So here we go, top six people. I've got Katie Pyle, 1978, which is Chris Pyle. I've got Karen Wynn. i got Evie Olson, Jason, Dustin, Shane. So Chris, start us off. What number? Yeah, Bardo Club, we will be. We will be. Chris Pyle's taking number two. You know what that means, Karen. What number would you like other than two? Karen's going one. You know what that means, Evie, you're up. Evie's taking four. So, Jason, what spot would you like? You can't take one, two, or four. So, three, five, or six for you, Jason. Which one would you like, sir? Do 
Jason's taking three. Dustin, five or six. Dustin's taking five, which then means Shane gets six. Now, I will say this just out of the kindness of my heart and everybody else. Please, please, please. Do you have something in your throat? You have kindness in your heart. Do you have something in your throat? All right. So, please, 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 if you enter for a chase... What we have to do moving forward is if you cancel, if you come to pick it up and you cancel, we cannot have you in these chase boxes because we have so many people that want to join these chase boxes. And if we're, what I would honestly say, abusing the system where you're getting in on these and then denying them, then we have to stop having you guys be in the chase boxes, okay? We are just going to be as fair as possible. This is just a fair warning to everybody as far as that goes, okay? I think that's fair because look how many people are want in on this one well there's a lot of people that want in on a lot and you have people saying dang i really wanted that one so well, yeah, I mean, here we go oh here we go moving forward you guys saw the spots i'm gonna crack it quick pop that box all right taking the cardboard off beautiful new cans my nose is a little stuffy this evening from the damn weather karen Number one, and Robert Massey says his money is there. All right, so you can see I'm grabbing Karen. Here we go. What? Is it though? You could, Matt. It would just hold everything up, unfortunately. So, but I like that idea. There may be a way to do that. All right, so here we go. I opened up the plastic of it but it's a very cool looking can even of iron man there as you see out of twenty thousand. Ooh, i like this one okay what's it look like all right chase finders what does the chase look like what is is it a glow in the dark i'm gonna guess that's my guess chris pile knows everything about these cans so he should he should let us know whoa what was that the sugar table is that my phone probably if you read what i just read it's crazy why would you just read? all right here we go. Robert Massey said, my, oh, what am I doing? I'm doing it backwards. I'm sorry. Robert Massey was wrong. I'm sorry. Karen, would you like to see your Iron Man before we move forward? Oh, no mask. So you get to see Tony Stark. Even if you didn't. That is actually a really cool one. Eyeballs are a little close to the middle of his head, but still. I mean, that face is kind of long. Sounds exactly like me. Eyes close to the middle of my head and a long face. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. It's still a cool pop, Karen. But now we go to, you know who it is, Mr. 50 Percenter, Chris Pyle at number two. All right, Chris. Oh, you didn't get it. Not this time. This is we need like a soundboard. It would make it so much more fun for everybody. Number three, Jason. Why do we need a soundboard when we have you? I don't know. I'm not that good. It'd be so much better with a soundboard. What it though? I do believe so. All right, Jason. You got the original. So here we go. We're down to the second half of the box. What that Jason, means to everybody. Jason, number six and the one he got. I'm pretty sure. But... So we've got the we got the couple here. We got the couple still on the board, four and five. Or we have the single of Dustin Hoffman. Well, damn, Pierre doesn't want to hear you. He wants the soundboard. That's because Pierre and I have known each other for years. Years? What's we, years? A long time. Of, More than 10? Yeah. We used to go to Aquarius. That should tell you it's that long. Okay? Yeah. Yeah. You're just telling your age then. All right. So this is Evie. 
Ooh. What that means is we've got Dustin and Shane left. It's 50-50. Put a vote, folks. Is it five or six? Who's going to get it? Dustin or Shane? Dancing on <laughs> I hate this. I can't see the comments. Really? Oh, because it's YouTube. Yeah. We've got two for six, one for Dustin, and it's Dustin. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go out of order. We're going Shane Everett, number six. Oh, man. This is the best part out of three. So Shane and Evie had a two out of three shot of getting this chase, basically, knowing the first three didn't get it. So the question is, Sam. Shane's wrong. Oh, no. That means number five, Dustin Hoffman got it. So what this means is, Dustin, you said you're coming picking your pops up on Thursday. You have this chase. You better come get this thing. One out of 3,300. Dustin, would you like to see your chase pop? All right. He says open it. It's a great snag. I think there's a lot of jealous people out there. We did. This was the only box we got of these, by the way, folks. There he is. Mr. Stark himself. Very cool. What? The eyes are the same on this one. I don't think they look too close together. The eyebrows are one. very prominent. Very prominent eyebrows. You know what? Some people have prominent eyebrows, okay? You don't. Because I wax them. Oh. No. Come on. <laughs> have you seen when I don't wax them? I haven't. <laughs> Dustin backs out. I call dibs. Uh, all right. Let's keep that sale rolling on. Second half for 20 bucks. This is a guy I would use this team on NBA Jam all the time because of the glove. Number 72. We got that spring convention. Sean Kemp. How much? How much if I make this second shelf? Oh God, dude! I almost made it. Nebula, you have not. From Popeyes. I do. That chicken at Popeyes is money. You're so secluded. Yes. It's on your parents. You can drive. Well, now I can. Back in the day, we only ever went to, like, one other place. I mean, if I'm, like, trapped. No, we were too poor. We didn't even go there. <laughs> Where? <laughs> we never had takeout. Right? But you said one place. Where is the one place? I forgot what I said. I can't. I, I forgot can't what I said. said. <laughs> uh, that never works. Oh, cool. Okay, these aren't exactly Funko, folks, but they're themed. So are they by Funko? I'm pretty sure they're, they're not. Funko. They're by Mighty Mugs. For twelve bucks, who wants a Mighty Mug Iron Man? Then why are they here? This was. I want to say this might have been before Funko. I remember these a long time ago. I could be wrong, but it's ish. Ago, it's when ish. When dinosaurs walk the earth, these were out. Yep. These are from like thirteen hundred A.D. or something. Mighty Mugs, Iron Man, following up Iron Man with Iron Man. No, not really. Let's try this one quick then. How about Cobra Commander? Cobra! Sam, listen, Sam put these on the cart. I did not. I didn't. They, well, I didn't. They were there. Robert Massey wants the Iron Man anyways. It worked out. Fluff trying to blame it on me. That crap wasn't there.
Yeah, I know. I know. This the same too? Okay, so then I'll just use it for both those. I don't know, Carrie. I see your name now off YouTube. Before I didn't see it, now I do. All right, for 11 bucks, number 251, we have Bell in the garter robe. Ben Gonzo taking the Cobra Commander. See, they're going. Well, I'm up. Phil Bussman, I thought you'd get this one for sure. Sweet. Yeah, Dustin, I still see the full name. You're good. Ryan Loveless, are you? Yep. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah. I got actually Jim Cleland came in first with Snake Bell. They all came in at once and Jim was first. So, Ryan, no problem. It was going to go to Phil next, but Jim Cleland came in first. But now I'm just blind. That would be amazing. I'm trying to – Funko never calls me back, Dustin. They never call me back. 17 bucks. Here we go, number 56. No Trooper, Walgreens exclusive. That's, you don't All right, I got Joe Carlson coming through on my screen first. There is a lot of people on YouTube now, I'm not going to lie. All right, for 11 bucks. This is a cool one. 453, 25th anniversary, Bulbasaur, all silver. How many of these do we have, Sam? I've got two for sure of these Bulbasaurs. I've got Kevin Hellenberg and Matt Anderson. Both YouTubers on there. Okay. Got this? Yeah. I believe. Whoa. Sam, you want to check when you come back, see if we have any up front just in case, because we have like four claim. All right, so for sure I've got Matt Anderson and Kevin Hellenberg. If Sam finds any more, it would go to Connor and then Dustin. All right, somebody may be into this show for $11. What we have here is we have number 790, Coach Bombay from the new Mighty Duck series. I know, right, Pile? Dude, I email him. I message him. I even went as far as, I don't know if I should say this on uh, live. But I went as far as Instagram messaging the guy that made Funko. No lie. No lie. All right. So I've got Jim Cleland, Matt Anderson, Dustin Hoffman. Good claims, gentlemen. Really? Okay. That was it for Bulbasaur. Is there everybody? 
kid rocking on the real McCoy. And now we're just blind. Kid rap. Gross. What? That's nasty. Why? I guess. Okay. Next up, honestly, though, we should. I think we gotta go with that theme. Find me all the reasons you can. Which way there is Oh. I'm going down. You know what? What? Next up for eleven dollars, we've got the Goldberg goalie. I'm telling you, man, I'm gonna be working on all this stuff. You're gonna what? Like that TV guy, whatever his name is, TV whatever. We're gonna get a we're gonna get a big old show. I don't even know what the fuck he said. Whoa. All right, I got Jim Cleland and Matt Anderson as of right now. I feel like it's warm in here. Maybe. Ah! And Dustin Hoffman. Looks like we got a theme going. I can't remember if I remember reading or seeing or something. Did this guy lose like a ton of weight? Probably. Yes, he did. I remember seeing it on Reddit. On Reddit. Uh, Reddit is life. See it on Reddit? Life is life. Yeah. Which you obviously don't live. I mean, I am pretty busy. Mm, with what? Building yourself doesn't count. Whoa. Why doesn't it? That's a better question. <laughs> Pretty sure people make a living out of that. All right, next up. Not a lot. Either. For Fulton Reed, number 791, Mighty Ducks Ooh, theme going. Prices. Yeah. Ooh, Joe Carlson getting in on this action now. I like it. So I got Joe Carlson, Jim yeah. Cleland, Matt Anderson, and Dustin Hoffman. <laughs> Karen, I'd be mad. That would have been great to be an extra. What? Carrie could have been an extra in Mighty Ducks. I was supposed to be. Not this one, the old school one. They, they filmed it in Northfield, Minnesota. That's what she's talking about. The yeah. old school one. Yeah. I was supposed to be. I actually got hired on to do it. So I why didn't you do it? I couldn't get a ride. How old were you? I was young. I lived. I was a young kid still. Then, I couldn't get a ride. I got hired on for it. Wait, did your parents take you to get hired on, or like what? Happened? No, you applied online, or like over the phone. They called me back. I was gonna say there was not effing internet right. at your age. Okay, let's be real. Wow. Right. How, okay. You want to talk about dating somebody? I'm just telling you, there was not internet. Don't lie to me. There was not internet. It was okay. So actually, how it works is it was newspaper ads. Knew it. Because that's the same way I applied for Honest to God, Batman and Robin. Shut up. Yeah. Hey, so why weren't your parents give you a ride? I think they were working. Oh. Can't give you crap about that. Who would have thought? I could have probably had a big role, like getting hit in the nuts with a puck or something. All right, where are we at? So I got Matt, Jim, Joe, and then Dustin. Where's my, uh, I feel like I'm falling behind here. Mean girl. I, I, 
Are there any more of those? Or was that it? Perfect. We did Diego, right? Yes. All right, here we go. I believe this is the last one of the crew. 792, Adam Banks. I already know Matt wants one. Andrea, I highly doubt it. Highly doubt it. Now, I would have made a hell of a Robin. We let's be honest. Some, did yeah, didn't somebody still want one? I don't know. They were sitting here. No, okay. Neither of us saw them. They were right in front of our faces the whole time. Oh. Wait, was it this one? Damn. Chris Lee. Ha <laughs> ha. Can you put it over there, please? Yeah. All right. All right. So what I have is I've got Jim Cleland, Matt Anderson, Dustin Hoffman, Joe Carlson, and Jason. Dustin, I see you. What's wrong with you? I hurt. My hip. Working myself in the ground. It's okay, I forget I don't want Not all of us can take vacations. because some people have already been there. It was my honeymoon. I got a bathrobe that says kitten. I'm sure that was ruined. All right, just catching up here, folks. Let's make sure. Yeah, Jason, I did get you in here already. This is going to be a lot of cleanup tonight. What's happening, Christina? All right, perfect. Okay, so I'm all caught up. So, nice. Jason, no, the Darth Vader was claimed. Wait, let's All right, next up for fourteen dollars. I'm sorry, for only eleven bucks. You got one of the bigger home run hitters in the league, Vlad Guerrero Jr. Number seventy one. I don't even know, Joe. I don't think we got five. I thought we just got four of them today. No Vlad Juniors out there, fans? I don't know if we do. I don't think we do. I thought that was it, but. All right. Sorry, Vlad. Home runs don't matter in this one. 
Next up for 14 bucks, it's not who does number two work for, it's number five. 1117 from the Umbrella Academy. I just don't think these are going to go over. I think I'm going to pass on these two. No. These two? Nobody's even. Oh, buying. though, okay. Yeah. Though, I thought you were talking about those no. two. I was like, what? Does it have a price? No. There's a one on the outside. Ah, my chair got stuck. Holy moly. All right, next up. Didn't we have this one last week or was it Morty? No, we had that one last week. Oh. For 11 bucks, number 956, Rick with Glorzo. Uh, Morty. Blech. Can you handle it, Meowth? Uh, are you fucking serious right now? Wow. What? Yeah, Matt, I'll see if maybe it's coming in next week and I can message you and let you know, okay? Get out of here. You go take a piss. Whoa. Are you serious right now? Yeah, I am. You know what? I am sad I can't see these on my screen. So, okay, never mind. All right, $13. We got two of them. Mr. Brad gave it away. He's not supposed to. We got Meowth. I still need to see the episode of why Meowth can talk to people. I heard it's a sad episode. I got Matt Anderson for one. Who will be the next one? Come on, someone's got to want meow. Otherwise, I'm going to end up getting him for, for my Logan. He does have a weird face on this one, though. I know, Phil, I got to get it. That last one got lost. I don't know where it went or if we got in someone else's bag. And I just haven't been able to craft in the longest time. Carrie, nothing to spoil yourself with, nothing you see. Oh, I got Caitlin. Caitlin, I got you for that last Meowth. That's a good one. Meowth is adorable. Did you just grab a candy bar? I only saw, so I saw Caitlin's, I see, yeah, I Caitlin's comments all came in at once. Mm -hmm. Oh, good. All right, can you guys hear this? We don't know if this is a chase or not. $13, you can get a sealed Egon. Soda. Whoa, Andrea. Sugar-free, fat pee. Fat free. Damn, this 
lot to clean up tonight. <laughs> what? I don't see your comment, so. Now, Matt, I don't know if this is a chase. That's what I'm saying. So I just want to make sure. And I can open this up live, whoever gets it, if you want it. But I can't guarantee it's 13 bucks. <sighs> you see that, by the way? No, this is the last I see. So Jim is letting Phil Busman have that bell. Because Phil asked if he could buy it from him. So, gotcha. Chris Pyle, would you like me to open it? Or do you want to do the pleasure yourself, sir? All right. Chris says open it. Now, Chris, you're definitely going to want to stay tuned for some more. So it looks like it was a normal, Chris. Matt said he wanted it. Oh, I'm sorry, Matt. I mean, you still want it, Matt? All right, guys, here's a couple. I have, now these ones have been opened, but they haven't been taken out of the bag yet, okay? But I do know what they are. So, if anybody would like a regular Vampire Jack, I have it here for $11. What do you want? Marker, please. Yeah. Thank you. So $11 on the Vampire Jack. Yep, but if he's the chase, it goes for 46. So, worth it. Claim Fulton Reed. Who's Fulton Reed? I don't know. All right, Matt, I did see the comment for that. I don't either. Oh, it's one of those mighty ducks. Oh, okay. I feel like we still have one of those. Though. It's the. All right, next up. I don't know that we have one of those. Now this one has been open. It oh, is no. Peyton. Peyton's Nerf World. Peyton's Nerf World. What name can we put it under? Now, we still have the can and everything. This is the normal Rosie. So she is $13. If anybody is interested for the Rosie for 13 We do have one. I just have We one. do have a Fulton Reed left, Peyton. If you just want to let us know the name, we can put this under. Sorry. I'm slipping. Did you feed in your face? Well. Oh. Peyton Bernard. Gotcha. All right. Now, if you're all ready. First, oh, I put 15. Why did I put 15? for 13, I've got two of these. They are sealed. You do have the opportunity at a chase. There's only 7,500 of these. All right, so this is what I got. Pyle, I'll give you one. 
And then Evie Olson came in at number two. So Chris Pyle, I'm going to stop this for a second. I'm going to let you take a pick. Chris Pyle, do you want the left or the right can? Whoa. So Chris Pyle, left or right can, or do you want it opened, or do you want to open it yourself? And Evie, do you want yours open or open it yourself? Oh, gosh. Come on, dude. This is like a no win for me. You want to pick Sam? You want to pick which one Pyle gets? Sam picks right. Woo! So, Chris, Sam picks this one. Do you want it open? Aaron Steele, the Muhammad Ali is 36. 36 on the Muhammad Ali. All right, Chris. Good luck, man. Remember, Sam picked it. Good luck to you also. Oh, geez. Okay. Here we go, man. So it looks like you got the normal one. Do you want to see it or do you want to keep it sealed, Chris? <laughs> what the heck? All right, Aaron Steele's going to claim the Muhammad Ali up there. Thanks, Aaron. So, Chris, just let us know if you want that opened or not. Got the other one, Evie. Evie Olsen got the other one. Oh, I love the smell of these things, though. Give me cancer. What? You're not supposed to smell that stuff. What the hell is going on here? This thing's like all kind of stuck to it. Yeah. One. What's funny is it shows him with a red blaster, but then he has, it looks pinkish, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. So that one's piles, right? Yeah. So, Chris, this is yours. Did you ask Evie if she wanted hers open? Evie, I assume you want yours open. Is that correct? Oh, I got to put it back in the wrapper. Did you show her? Is hers a regular or what? Well, you want yours open, Evie? Hang on. Evie, you won. One out of two, and who would have thought we'd get a chase? One out of two. It's one not out my of fault. one. It's not my fault, pile. <laughs> one out of one thousand. Sorry, one thousand two hundred and fifty. This isn't my I don't fault. Know. I, this is why I don't pick. Is it flocked? It's flocked. That's what it is. Okay, I could not tell the difference at all, but he's flocked. So this is all furry here, and here. And his boots. I bet you know all about furries. What is that supposed to mean? Aren't furries like uh like where people dress up like animals? <laughs> Congrats, Evie. I don't know if we've ever had this where we've had just two and we've actually had a chase. That's pretty cool. Don't get them mixed up now. Nope, that's Evie's. So wait, I need to know. I'm out of stickies. You. Do you have a pen at least? Yes, I there. do. Wait, use that other one. Yeah, it's not even a sticky. Oh, it's not? No, but I got one. No, the one you had. Oh. Okay, so that one's Evie. Well, that's what I said. Wait. But I said use that one. I know, but I got one. Oh. Coming up. That's why I did But this one was the Chase one, right? Yeah. So then... Oh, you're trying to do a different color? You told me to do Evie, and <clears throat> so I wrote Evie. Oh, whatever. Evie got okay, the Chase, true. right? Okay. Next up. You hear that? Evie, he's trying to screw it up. Uh, uh, uh. Thanks, Phil. 
Appreciate that. Next up, here we go again. 13 bucks. I've got two Devo. So you can do one each, one a piece, $13. You got another shot. All right. So I've got Matt Anderson for a first can. I've got Evie Olson for the second can. So Matt Anderson, first off, would you like left or right? And would you like your can opened? Evie got in on both. What if she went two for two? That'd be hell of impressive. Okay, Matt wants right and open. So this time no one picked. All right, Matt, good luck. The second question is, do you want it opened, open? So it looks like we got the normal one. How many of them are there? There's 8,000. It looked like you got the normal one here, Matt. Do you <laughs> Whipped it good. Do you want it open, open? Or would you like it sealed in the bag? We're going two levels there for you. Did you know the guy who played Count Dooku in Star Wars was the inspiration for James Bond? No. He also was in World War Two. So when, like, what's the what's the director's name of? Um, All right, of open, open. Of what? Lord of the Rings. Oops. I don't remember his name. Peter Jackson. Is sure. That it? Yeah. And he was like, imagine what this... Dude, these are like sticking these black bags. And he was like, imagine what a guy sounds like when he's being stabbed. He's like, I don't need to imagine. I know what it sounds like. That's actually pretty cool. These little cans get cooler and cooler every time. That is a cool looking can. All right. We're sealing her back up for you. Good, sir. We got your name on it. All right, Abby. Here we go. Good luck. Can you go two for two? Evie says, open it. If you win this one, you're the new lucky. Because there's only two total. I don't know if we've ever had this good of luck. It's a normal, Evie. Still super cool. I know those lenses actually look really cool too, Nebula. All right, so you know what? I feel like we got to follow that one up with the first six people to type in the word claim. You're going to get into our last box, $15 Bullwinkle Soda Box. Good luck, everybody. All right, let's see who we got. So I've got Jesse Coos, number one, Chris Pyle, number two, Brandy, number three, Robert, four, Evie, five, Matt Anderson, six. Evie's getting in on them all. So Jesse. I'm on a stickies. I got you. Unless you want to do it, I'll just write it here, I guess. I mean, I can't see the thingy. No, I got you. You write it's... the thingy, I'll write the rest of the thingies. Okay. I mean, because you're behind the scenes, I know you know what I mean. All right, so Jesse, what spot would you like? Oh, people want to see the mic here. I got to go get it. Oh, yeah. It's the thingy. The thingy and the thingy. And then after Jesse is Chris Pyle. I think this may be the most expensive my hero academia pop so far. Possibly. It's pretty cool. Mm. What are you doing? What is there? No. It's it. the same one that's always there. The same one. What? Yeah. All right. So Jesse is going to Chris Pyle. What spot would you like?
And after Chris Pyle claims, I need Brandy Hoffman to let you let me know her spot. So Chris Pyle, anything but two. Chris Pyle's going five. Brandy, what spot would you like? Pop it like it's hot. Robert Heavy Matt. Brandy's going six. Robert, what spot would you like? One, three, or four. Robert's going one. Evie Olsen, you're up, and then Matt gets the leftover. So, Evie, three or four? <clears throat> this could turn out to be really funny. Like, really funny or really good luck, depending how this goes down. Abby says four. Okay, so if everybody goes back to the beginning, Matt Anderson got in, and Matt Anderson said it's in spot three. Okay? Nobody took spot three, which left Matt Anderson not even getting a chance to pick his spot to get the number three spot. So, Matt Anderson, if you get this one, I'm pretty sure you may get some people to – write you about being a mind reader and maybe reading their fortunes. Let's see how this goes. I'm just going to pop this open quick. All right. I feel like we should really, I feel like we should really start with Matt's number. Do it. I really think we should. Why though? Why do you feel that way? Because Matt didn't get to pick his number and he says the winner is three. Matt. Are we going to finish finish this one off before? before. Yes. Yes. Okay, okay, yes. Okay. He said it way up there. Then let's start. So let's here start. we go. Matt. Oh, it's not that Bullwinkle. But it is. What? I'm so confused. Fearless leader. Oh, okay. Now it makes sense. Get it. Uh, ha, ha, ha. All right, Matt. First off, good luck. Second off. Uh, wait a second. They always, like, on Reddit, they always make fun of. They call, like, the North Korean dude the fearless leader. I've never seen... <sighs> This dude in that cartoon, though. It's like there's a connection. How are we I need, feeling? I need to go and watch it now. Oh, I caught it then. Didn't. You got the normal. You got the normal. So it wasn't three. But you had everybody on the edge of their seat. I will say that. Wait, you didn't write one. Now. Ah, oh, you did. Matt, do you want it opened or do you want to keep it sealed since we know what it is? Your call. Your call here, Matt. All right. Oh, well, open it. Sounds good. Here we go. We did have a lot of people go over to YouTube. I love it. Okay. Okay. Green outfit. There he is. Did your phone just vibrate? Yeah, motion at my front door. Mm. Is it your duck? Who knows? If it is, they're crapping is that what on the concrete. The crap the they crap on the concrete. Why? I don't know. Shouldn't be an F you. I let them wander. I didn't say what? Who said F I said it shouldn't be an F you from them. I let them wander. Oh. All right, folks, where should we go next? Matt got his spot. Wait, give me his. Right here. Should we go one, two, five, or six? You guys make the call. First number that gets two, we pick. I got six, five, four. We need one more. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. All right, number five, Chris Pyle, we're drawing you. Let's go. What was the name he really hates being called? That ran oh, there. shit. No, you called him something totally different. What? <laughs> Chris, you got the normal. Oh, it seems he's not 50 for 50 anymore. 50 for 50. <laughs> he's not 50 for 50 anymore, okay? He lost oh. both times tonight. Get it? I know what you, yeah. All right. So five's out. Where are we going next, people? One, 
Oh, shoot. Oh, and Sam's making the dumb mistakes. Okay. One, two, four, six. Where are we going? All right. Looks like number two, Jesse. And then we'll go to four next since that got the next most. They need to switch it up. The Geico commercials? Yeah. Do you remember when there used to be like you get those phone calls and they'd be like, this is Gecko, not Geico. No. Jesse, you got the normal. But that does mean we're going to four because that was the next vote. So, Evie, we're pulling yours next. Which means if Evie doesn't get it, it's between Robert and Brandy Hoffman. Pulling for you, Evie. Ooh, ooh. Still could be two Watch, out of no, four. Evie will lose tonight. I'm like, I'm pulling for you. Yup. No. Yep. I should have kept my mouth closed. Uh, all right, you guys vote. One or six. Which one are we opening? One or six. Brandy or Robert. The night starts now. You need to stop with the Lonely Island. <laughs> All right, I got two for six. Oh, God, we got okay, a lot of sixes. Close. All right, that, that's it. Robert, you're either getting it with the last one. Right now it's 50-50. And according to Sam, Chris isn't 50 for 50 anymore. 50-50, yeah, 54-50, same thing. <laughs> Add an extra word in there. Here we go. There it is. Brandy, you got it. All right, Brandy, do you want to see it? Jesus, wow. The night starts now. Big roll with us. All right, Brandy says, open it, please. Snapping up the neck while we roll the nub. I thought that was very pretty good. You know, you know. Oh, it's so good. I, I bought it, and then we I'll watch it all the time. Hard. Instead of green, we got the blue. Yeah, Katie, we're going to be doing this moving forward. It's going to be YouTube, Twitch, and on Facebook all at the same time. So moving forward, it's going to be on all three platforms. All right, who's ready for the big boy of the evening? Sam already gave it away. We all know it's my hero. Well, people ask for it, you know. Sam, what? that right there. Okay. Fancy. Oh, you think it's fancy now? Wait till you get to see the behind the scenes when we have two cameras going. All right, guys. Here we go. The fancy Bobancy, my hero, Academia. Thanks. I was gonna guess, but oh no. Number six thirty-seven. We have the Fall Convention Dobby. Somebody right now behind the scenes going, oh, shit, I've been needing this, and I can't find it anywhere. Everyone asks for Dobby, <clears throat> but can you afford Dobby? Ooh, can you Abba Dobby? Ooh. <laughs> uh. Uh, yes, Matt, it is. It's the 8-bit chase. Correct. Nebula, I, I know you're contemplating this one really, really hard. Really, really hard right now. <laughs> it's true. It is true. That's my fault. It is not a $40 price tag. <laughs> uh, it's true. <laughs> I see it now. All right, Matt, we got you. Thank you. Boom, boom, boom. Otherwise, that's all oh. she wrote. Oh, did you forget one? Yeah. That's on you. Yeah. Nice. 
Nice try, Jim. <laughs> you ninkling boob. <laughs> I love it. Twisted the arm, Nebula. Uh, fine. Yep. You know you needed it. It's not you're not a completionist until. All right, guys, this is the last pop of the night. I totally forgot about this. I'm sorry. I don't know if we've had this one before on the sale or not. But number 1105, we've got Steve Irwin with, I don't know, is it Sue? Sweet. I've got Sweet. I've got multiple of these. You got six of them. Yeah, you got a big black piece in your face right there, other side. What? Right there. Oh, what the heck? where did that come from? That know. was my that was my Cindy Crawford mole. <laughs> <laughs> what if that was on the live sale? Like if we had the camera on there, I would have noticed it way sooner. God, that would have been a great blurb. That would have been great. Oh my god. Only I got to see it. It was pretty great. Yeah. All right. Cool. So. <laughs> Let's go down the list of who we got. I've got Aaron Steele with the first claim. As I write them, I'm going to say the names. As you write them, you're going to say the names. Katie Swanson. You didn't say this one. Aaron Steele. I said Aaron Did Steele. Okay, yeah. I didn't hear you. I was like, um, excuse you. Okay. I've got Peyton. I've got Sean. I've got Nebula. Where are we at? I should get a free Steve. <laughs> Leslie, it is a dog. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Dustin Rube. Yeah, Matt, we can definitely go through the unclaimed really quick. All right, so we've gone through them all. Now, what I'm going to do, just real quick, before we end the sale and I show you the unclaimed, uh, I'd like to go through how to finish this off, guys. Please, if you could, go ahead and, and private message us. Uh, honestly, Facebook is the easiest. If you're on YouTube and that's all you have, you can do it through YouTube. But private message us. Let us know if you need your items shipped. If you're going to pick them up at the Rochester store, Invergrove Heights, or how you need that done. Please send us your email, and if you remember what you claimed, that's awesome. If not, we have it written down. However, once you get us that stuff, we will get working on these invoices tomorrow for you guys. Once the invoices are paid, we will go ahead and we will ship them off or whatnot. Now, folks that are going to pick up in Rochester, Immigrove Heights, if you could, please send us your emails. We still are going to try to start invoicing people because we have been getting a lot of stuff that have been staying in stock, okay? So if you're cool with us sending you an invoice, Please do that. You can still come pick a pick it up. Just let us know when you send us your email. Hey, go ahead and invoice us. All right. So let's go through what was not claimed. We still do have a stitch in Rocket number one hundred two. It's thirty five dollars. For eleven dollars, we have Vlad Guerrero Jr. from the Toronto Blue Jays. For fifteen, we have Dr. J. Julius Irving. For $12, we have Lamar Jackson, no helmet. For $14, we have not number two, but number five from the Umbrella Academy. For $20, we have Sean Kemp. Leslie Stitch is 35 on Rocket. We have Ben from the Umbrella Academy. We have a 
older school pop here in the Civil War, Scarlet Witch, 133 for 70 again. Stick is chocolate wasted. <laughs> and then we have Diego for 14. And then I also have a Daredevil over here for 21 from the Netflix series, I believe. That's that one. And then we have the Rick with Glorzo for 11. So that is everything that we do have left. As always. All right, I've got you there, Matt. Thank you for that one also. <clears throat> As always, thank you, everybody, for tuning in. We really appreciate the business, the fact that we can earn your guys' business. If you need anything else, always reach out to us. Hope you guys have a great night. Remember, we do have the gaming sale on Thursday. We have toys and collectibles on Friday. And then Saturday at 1.30, what we changed is it's now at 1.30, not in the evening. We're doing back issue comics. So, again, thank you to everybody. Hope you all have a great night, had fun, and love this new platform. See ya.